In a remarkable turn of events, NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has uncovered something so profound, it has left astronomers stunned and sparked heated discussions across the global scientific community. A few weeks ago, this revolutionary telescope revealed the earliest known galaxy in the observable universe, a jaw-dropping milestone on its own. However, Webb has now surpassed even that discovery. It has detected a supermassive black hole that's not only existing in the early universe but is moving away from its host galaxy at a breathtaking speed of 4 million miles per hour. This phenomenon is unlike anything previously documented, and its implications could shake the very foundations of astrophysics and cosmology. Let's start with the basics. A supermassive black hole is a type of black hole with a mass ranging from millions to billions of times that of our Sun. These cosmic giants typically reside at the centers of galaxies, anchoring them with their immense gravitational pull. In fact, most large galaxies, including our own Milky Way, harbor one at their core. These black holes do not simply float around freely in space. They are usually fixed in place by the gravity of the surrounding galaxy, making the recent James Webb discovery especially puzzling. The idea of such a colossal object, one with such extraordinary gravitational force, being ejected or traveling independently from its galaxy is almost unthinkable. How can something this massive and powerful be moving through space at such speed, defying the cosmic structures that typically hold them in place? The discovery challenges long-standing theories about the nature of black holes and their roles in galactic formation and evolution. More importantly, it has astronomers asking a terrifying question. What kind of force or cosmic event could cause a supermassive black hole to be hurled away from its galaxy at such an unimaginable velocity? This runaway black hole, as it's now being called, was spotted thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope's extraordinary sensitivity to infrared light. Unlike previous telescopes that relied heavily on visible and ultraviolet light, Webb peers deep into the universe by observing the infrared spectrum allowing it to capture images and data from the early universe, billions of light years away. In this particular case, astronomers noticed a peculiar trail of ionized gas stretching across 200,000 light years. This glowing line wasn't just a random streak in the cosmic canvas, it was the smoking gun pointing to something much bigger. Upon closer inspection, the origin of this gas trail seemed to be a supermassive black hole speeding through space, plowing through interstellar material and leaving behind a trail of shocked gas glowing in its wake. But what could cause such a massive object to be expelled from the center of its galaxy? One possible explanation involves galactic mergers. Galaxies are known to collide and merge over cosmic timescales. When two galaxies merge, their central black holes begin a slow, spiraling dance toward one another, eventually fusing into a single, even more massive black hole. However, if a third galaxy, and with it, a third black hole, enters the scene, it can throw off the balance entirely. In such a chaotic three-body interaction, one black hole can be violently flung out of the system, a victim of gravitational slingshotting. This is known as a recoil event, and it's one of the few theoretical models that could explain what Webb has just observed. Yet, this scenario has always been viewed as extraordinarily rare more of a cosmic anomaly than a frequent occurrence. That's what makes this new finding so important. If a supermassive black hole can indeed be ejected during galactic mergers, it would rewrite our understanding of how galaxies grow and evolve. It could even explain why some galaxies appear to be missing their central black holes. Perhaps they were kicked out, hurtling into the cosmic abyss like this one. The sheer velocity of this black hole, 4 million miles per hour, is mind-boggling. To put it into perspective, that's fast enough to travel from Earth to the Moon in under four minutes. At that speed, the black hole will never return to its galaxy, it's on a one-way trip through intergalactic space. This raises another compelling question. What happens to a galaxy that loses its central black hole? Is it still able to maintain its structure? Will it collapse or evolve differently compared to others? Our current understanding of galactic stability depends heavily on the presence of a supermassive black hole at its core. If this critical component is missing, the ripple effects could influence star formation, stellar orbits, and even the overall shape of the galaxy. 
Even more haunting is the idea that this runaway black hole is likely consuming matter as it travels, forming a disk of superheated material around it called an accretion disk. This disk emits intense radiation, making it visible even from billions of light years away. That's how Webb spotted it, not the black hole itself, but the violent radiation produced as it devours anything in its path. The result is a trail of glowing gas, stretching like a scar across the universe, marking the black hole's chaotic journey through space. The implications of this discovery are staggering. If confirmed, it would mean that the universe is far more dynamic and volatile than previously imagined. Black holes, once thought to be stationary guardians of galactic centers, may not be as fixed as we believe. They might be on the move, and some could even be headed in our direction, invisible to all but the most powerful instruments like Webb. The James Webb Space Telescope is proving to be not just a telescope, but a time machine and cosmic detective. It's allowing humanity to observe the universe in its infancy, to uncover events that occurred just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. And in doing so, it's turning long-held scientific theories on their heads. Astronomers are now forced to reconsider their models of black hole formation, galaxy evolution, and cosmic interactions on a scale never before possible. So what does the future hold for this runaway black hole? It will likely continue to drift through intergalactic space, surrounded by a halo of gas and possibly even stars that were once part of its galaxy. Some astronomers speculate that the black hole could form a kind of rogue star system, dragging along any celestial bodies caught in its gravitational grip. Others believe it might eventually slow down and be captured by another galaxy though this would require an extraordinary set of circumstances. Meanwhile, the discovery has opened new avenues for research. Could there be more runaway black holes out there, invisible to us until we develop the tools to detect them? What other cosmic events have we missed because our instruments weren't sensitive enough? With Webb leading the charge, the answers may be closer than ever. The discovery also underscores the importance of continued investment in space science and exploration. Each new mission brings with it the potential to answer age-old questions, and to ask new ones we never thought possible. The universe is not a quiet, predictable place. It's a realm of violent collisions, chaotic movements, and forces so extreme they defy imagination. Yet thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, we are beginning to glimpse this true nature. As for Earth, there's no need to panic. This particular black hole is billions of light years away. But the knowledge that such titanic forces exist, and that black holes can roam the cosmos untethered, reminds us just how vast, mysterious, and untamed the universe really is. Each new discovery brings both awe and humility. We are small, but we are curious. And through the lens of Webb, we continue to reach across time and space, seeking to understand the incredible story of the cosmos. Stay with Discovery at 2.0 as we continue to explore these unfolding wonders and bring you the most groundbreaking revelations from the frontiers of space.